Hey guys, today we're going to fix a gas can. This is one of those newfangled gas cans without a vent on it. And they drive me crazy. So what we're going to do is we're going to install a vent cap on it. We're going to 3D print a vent cap and we're going to install it on this can. The only thing that i found that sticks nylon is is uh, PVA glue which is Elmer's 5050 on glass and uh, basically I paint it on with a, a sponge brush let it dry and print away so this here is basically what I use it's watered down 5050 I keep it in a little Tupperware container I keep a little sponge brush in there and it's uh, basically Elmer's glue watered down and here's how we do it Take this, run it back and forth, don't have to go real heavy on it. The lighter you go, the quicker it dries, and it actually holds better when there's a light coat. Spread it around as much as you can. This holds amazing for nylon. I haven't found anything that works better than this for nylon. That's it, we'll let that dry and pop it in the printer. I put the sponge brush right back in there. It's just the right size. It fits in the container. Look at that. We're going to let this cool off a little bit and these parts should pop right off. We've allowed the glass in this plate to cool down. But this is stuck on there pretty good. Let's see if we can do this without losing a finger or breaking the glass. Huh. There it goes. I printed this with a brim, an 8 millimeter brim. There it goes. That came off pretty good actually. We're going to trim this flash on here. So this is what we got after the parts are trimmed. So these parts, this takes a 5 8 inch hole. We're going to drill a hole and carry it here and when we're pouring we'll hold it here. So somewhere in the middle, probably around there. That's where we're going to drill a hole, a 5 8 inch hole. And we're going to have a vent cap in this. I think this is going to work out great. This nylon is some strong stuff. It is unbelievable how strong this is. This is really why I got a 3D printer to make good, strong, functional parts. I think this is going to do the trick, man. And printing nylon is really not all that bad. You just got to keep it dry. Uh, on uh, Thingiverse said to use the 5 8 inch bit. I'm using a spade bit for this because spade bit cuts good in plastic. The regular metal bit will dig in and pull the drill through. Alright, so we're going to put it right about here. Let's see. When I'm pouring, my hand is here, and when I'm carrying, my hand is here. Yeah, somewhere right about there. Nice hole. All right, push that right in there. Well, that's nice. I'll screw the cap on. That is awesome. And that's how you put a vent in a gas can. That is awesome. Made out of nylon which is impervious to gasoline. So that's what this channel is about. We're going to be, uh, I fix things. I fix all kinds of things. And um, that's what I'm going to be basing this channel on from here on out is basically making and fixing things. Anything. This is a gas can. 
I have projects you wouldn't believe. This is what I do. I fix stuff. I've been uh, fixing stuff most of my life. So if you guys like these kinds of videos, please subscribe. Check out my playlist. I'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.